Look at the front where it says Ames real big. All right, everybody, we are at the one and only beautiful mire here in Boardman, Ohio. We're going to go see what they have in there for Halloween. What are we waiting for? Let's get in there where the air conditioner is on and it feels a lot better than this humidity out here. Plus, I need to bring my blood pressure and my temperature down after that Steelers game that we just had against the Bengals today. Oh, they got pumpkins. Already ready to go. Lots of pumpkins outside. I bet you we'll find more inside. They also have the Loft House sugar cookies, the things that taste bland until they put an overload of frosting on them. I don't care. I like them. Just as I figured, lots more pumpkins, and they're only $6. They're actually on sale for $5.49. Good deal. Harvest cake roll, pumpkin spice cupcakes, pumpkin squares, things little fall themed brownies more cupcakes chocolate cupcakes apple cinnamon cream cake build a skeleton sugar cookies harvest shortbread cookies cool they have little debbie fall party cakes they even have the pumpkin delight cookies and other than christmas time this is the only other time of year that these things are relevant they have reese's puffs bats and they have fruit brute fruit Root. Where the hell's the Count? We're gonna find Count Chocula. That's better. Lots of Count Chocula and Frankenberry. And, oh, good. They have Booberry and then Fruit Brute. All right. Cozy little fall decorations to make your house a home. Adorable. We have bags of Halloween candy, 260 pieces on sale for $24. That's a lot of candy. 220 pieces in that bag. Big size of Twix. Reese's, Kit Kats, Almond Joys, yuck. Scary Cakes, Ding Dongs, and Spooky Twinkies. <laughs> All right. Scary Cakes, though, with Scream Filling. Okay, check out their paper plates, their uh, dishware. Those are cool with the skulls on them. I, I like those. They even have the jack-o'-lantern one, but I like the skull ones. What's this one back here with the owl? Yeah, they have owls on that one. Eek! I got extension cords because I need them for lights because I'm decorating. I like all the plates they got. They have, they have a hell of a selection. They even have uh, general fall-themed ones for Thanksgiving, I guess. Cool. Look at these skeleton shirts. They glow in the dark, too. Little outfits for the little ones. Here are these sweatshirts. Here, hoodies. Who dares to light the black cat? The black flame candle. Hocus Pocus. I could not say that if I tried. They have little Halloween outfits for the little ones. Look at that. That's cool. Have a, what's that say? Have a fantastic Halloween. Spook Patrol. I cannot talk. Daddy is my boo. <laughs> Yard decorations. Cool. Look at these big jack-o'-lanterns here that light up. These things are huge. $70. Wow, damn. Look at these little buckets here, the little trick-or-treat buckets. They have all different colors here, too. Kind of remind me of the ones you'd find at McDonald's back when we were kids. Very cool. They have all kinds of different colors to choose from. They also have lots more candy to choose from. Oh, my gosh. I got Sour Patch Kids, Nerds, Starburst, Skittles. Oh, my gosh. I need to stay away from all this. This is so bad. Oh, they got the full-size candy bars in here. The full size 18 bars. $16.99 on sale for two for 30, so $15. Wow. They got more candy here. Crunch, payday. I like payday. Payday bars are good. 
Kit Kats. Can't go wrong with those. Almond Joy. I don't... Yuck. I just can't do them. We've seen this. Seen this. We got more candy here, too. Well, we'll go around that side then here. So, here we go. What, what are these Kit Kats? Breaking Bones. Crisp wafers and white cream. Okay, so white chocolate. Okay. We got a bag of these. Kayla ate all of them. I hope she enjoyed them. I bought them for the both of us, but that's... That's just how it goes. I'm glad she enjoyed them. I did get them for us to eat, not look at, but I would have enjoyed some too had there been any left for me. <laughs> but we were talking about getting a new uh, bag of candy. Look at these ones. What are these? Marshmallow flavored cream. Wow, okay, I kind of want to try these ones. I bet that would be good. I think we'll have to get a bag of those. Five bucks, really? Wow, that seems like a lot. What's this one here? Dark chocolate. Okay, I'm not the biggest fan of dark chocolate, though. But that's okay. We'll check out the candy and we'll look at the toys that were behind me here. Regular candy. Okay. Best treats in town. Oh, you could pack, like, your own trick-or-treat box and that. That's kind of cool. They make that nice and easy. I have a lot more candy over here. Blow Pops, Dum Dums. What's this? Candy Carnival. It's just generic candy, but it's a variety pack. Snickers. Dots. Three Musketeers. Snickers. Twix. Hundred grand. That's every kid just wants to go out and just dig into a hundred grand. If it was money, damn right I would. More candy, guys. There is no shortage on candy, despite what people were posting online a while back. Oh, there's going to be a candy shortage for Halloween. Well, here's the proof that there is none. So the rumors need to stop. Seriously. All right, now that I showed you the candy, we're going to go take a look through these aisles with the Halloween goodies. Now, they don't have everything out yet because it is still early in the season. It is only early September. But you'd think by now they'd have a little bit more out there, especially since Spirit Halloween's completely stock full. That's cool. It's just a shame how hard they are to get back off the glass. They're just a pain. I like that. The light-up ceramic black tree. Well, it's pumpkins. They're just in the wrong place, but that's pretty cool. Trick or treat. Look at the little dogs. All the different little dogs that got the skeletons. Look at that one. <laughs> gnomes. Here we go with the gnomes. Wreaths, very cool. Those look like the shatterproof ornaments too, so you don't have to worry about it falling and hitting the ground and breaking. Look at these. I like the owl one. I get what's this one supposed to be? A rat? I'm guessing. Then you have a bat one behind it. Got the dog. Skeletons. Here. Speak no evil, hear no evil, see no evil. That's cool. Got the ravens. I don't like the ravens. I like these ravens, but I don't like the football team. For obvious reasons. These candle holders are called the skeleton hands. That hand is a little weird, but the candle holders are very cool. Yeah, you see this aisle's mainly empty. They have some Halloween cups here. The skeleton ones, I like that. It's just random decor. They had more behind me. Got candy dishes. I like the uh the bowl, this big bowl. Somebody stole Pokemon cards. That's a shame. They're not even worth stealing. Make your own Halloween art. That's cool. I like that. Now look at these uh, jack lanterns they have back here. I showed you the big one in the main aisle. Now they have these little ones here that are probably, well those are probably about the size of a, I don't know, a basketball. Those ones are about the size of a bowling ball, maybe a little bit smaller. But they're very cool. They have different colors. I like that one. I've never seen them in that color before. We're seeing them in pastel colors now like I've never seen before. They even have themed ones up here. That's pretty cool. They got these ones. Look how happy that one is. <laughs> Pixar light up pumpkins. Boy, they're almost out already. Wow. Random hand. <laughs> They don't have a shortage on Halloween lights. They have a lot here. I got orange ones and I have green ones at home. I need to get purple ones. I like the multicolor ones they have there. I would need probably a bigger set though. Instead of uh, 50, I would want 100 count like these ones here. But I like how these ones seem to be brighter. Well, those are LED. Those are just your standard ones, but that's okay. They even have them up here, garland style lights. 
cluster. Oh, here we go. Projection shadow light. Look how cool that looks in there. That's pretty sweet. Oh, I like how it changes to blue and green. They have rope lights. They have these LED flickering candles I think are pretty sweet. They uh, have a time or two where they stay on for six hours and they're off for 18. Very cool. They have the multicolored lights here where the bulbs are two different colors. That's pretty sweet. I like those. The spire web lights. That's cool too. 60 inch diameter. So that's pretty large. That's very large. Skeleton hands up light up. That's cool too. They have a cauldron mister. They have a fog machine. These flickering globe lights look cool too. I like these ones too. They're spiders. Beware. I like the neon style light. Beware. That's pretty sweet. I saw these too while I was filming the other things here. Cut resistant gloves. So it's a little bit safer. You don't have to worry about cutting your hand open when you're trying to carve a pumpkin. So that's nice. I like that. Now they have these little LED string light sets up here too. I assume they're supposed to be here. Yeah. Like all the different colors and st styles that they have here. I guess they're battery operated. Yes, they are. That's cool though. I like those. Flickering LED flame bulb. I love those. I love those. That's a lot of money though, but I like those a lot. Spooky light bulb too. We got witches hats. What are these ones? Just flickering light sets. Oh, they're supposed to look like flames. Okay, cool. Further down this aisle, they still have lots of summer stuff, just like they do the rest of this section here. So I'm, I, I enjoy that. I like seeing the summer stuff because I don't want summer to end. They got straw bales and they have scarecrows. Well, kind of. They're cool though. I like them. Halloween art. Look at all the little activity sets they have here for all the kids. They have a lot. I love the big Halloween wiggle eyes. <laughs> I got a set of those. I just never put them up anywhere. You know, it'd be fun though. Get a couple of beach balls that are all white and like paint like red on it to make them look bloodshot. Stick one of these on them and like throw them up in a tree because these glow in the dark too. Man, would that be creepy? You think? <laughs> Spider webs and Halloween door curtain. And the orange there, the orange tinsel, glitter spider cutouts. That's kind of neat. I have one similar to this, though. I like the purple one, though. I just like the purple. It looks good. Here you got spider webs. You have ghosts. What's the one behind it? Pumpkins, a ghost, and it looks like a kitty up on top. Yes. <laughs> Freaky fabric. Beware. Enter at your own risk. More door curtains. Look at that frame cutouts those are creepy looking too the tree's really cool the spooky tree the little table the top center pieces they have little pumpkins here too that's cool I, I like this a lot i really like this that's really cool i like that a lot they have other designs too they have one that says boo on it and one with a pumpkin on it behind that there's where the cutout hands are, that we that, like the one we saw a moment ago. Poise in this area under strict control. These signs are awesome. Look at this one here. <laughs> I like it. Zombie research facility. I like that too. Those are cool. Through the wall skeleton. That's cool. It makes it look like it's coming out through the wall. The Halloween shower curtain. <laughs> I like that with the shadow. The, the um, machete on there, door covers. They're all the same, yeah. Very cool. Little skulls and animal skeletons. Look at that, what's that? That's like a big bug. Creepy, they got the rats too. One thing I wanted to point out though, this is $3.99, this bat. I picked up one of these at Dollar Tree a couple years ago for a buck, so $1 versus four. They have a cobra too. That one's cool. Oh, double-headed cobra. Double trouble, it says. Flamingo skeleton. That's a new one. There's that. Gargoyles. Look at the octopus skeleton dragon. Yeah, it's an octopus. It lights up, too. That's cool. Never seen that before. What's this? The old skeleton fish. That lights up, too. Let me see if we could try it. Oh, is that cool? That's really cool. There's the octopus there. Yardsticks, and check out the huge climbing spider. It's 15 feet in size. That takes up the whole side of a house there. Halloween skeletons, I like these little skeletons. They have frogs, snakes, lizards, spiders. 
then we have more decorations over here. We have mermaid skeletons, clown skeletons, squeeze toys, nightmare before Christmas, the giant life-size posable skeleton there, a little bag of skulls. That's pretty cool. The angel skeleton. Then you have a uh, wall and tabletop decor here. That's just one-sided. That's cool. Good selection. Check this out, they even have cat toys. <laughs> Isn't that cool? So even our little furry friends can enjoy Halloween. I like the little mouse three pack there. I know Lee and Larry would go wild over those. Look at the witch there. What happened there? Looks like someone busted you right in the mouth. <laughs> Okay, what do we have with this? Fortune teller. It looks, do the hands move? It certainly looks that way. It's wall art. It says try me. Oh yeah, the, the hands do move. Oh, it, it, that's it. It died. Okay, great. <laughs> they have all these fake books too. That's just a prop. Oh wait, you push a button. Oh, two of them come out like that. Huh. Well. That's different. Sounded like a fart more than anything else. <laughs> Cracked face doll. That's what I look like when I first wake up in the morning. They have a big lawn walker here. Big guy there. Pumpkin headband. Decorate your pumpkin with these little lights instead of actual candles to make it safer. Speaking of being safe for the trick-or-treaters, they have little flashlights here. Paw Patrol. Looks like Spider-Man. Little scrunchy bars. What are these little beanies? Yeah, they have, I guess these glow in the dark too. Yeah, they do. How about that? Gloves too, glow in the dark gloves. They have little necklaces as well. I like that, they all light up too. Try me, push here, okay. That's cool. They, let's try these ones here too. Uh-huh, my aunt always buys these. And they got candy corn ones. That's about all candy corn is good for, is being a necklace. Because the correct way to eat actual candy corn is to take it and throw it right in the garbage. That skeleton's cool. Five foot hanging skeleton reaper. <laughs> Over here, then we go to masks. We have the big shark mask. Looks like he just did a big doobie there, okay. And we have these little masks too. Funny little alien. Lots of masks. Gas mask. That's funny, they have clown ones too. Evil clown masks. And I like the fact that they're in bags too to make it easier to put them out on display. And so people don't try them on. And you know, everybody's, well maybe not everybody, but people might be concerned with COVID. But here's my thing, if you bought one anyway after somebody tried it on or like that either either way when i would get that home i'd wash it wipe it down before i'd even consider putting it on again like with that misfits mask i bought that so i wasn't too concerned like the cowboy hat or deputy hat i should say they have witches hats as well look at this i like the pumpkin here that'd be cool by our front door i like that one they have ghosts too Frankenstein. Look at these big welcome signs. Wow, those are five feet tall, four and a half feet tall. Halloween craft kits. Wow, look how you can paint them all up. Pretty cool. They have, what's over here? Halloween party. Oh, see, cool. They have toys for the dogs, too. So not just the kitties, but the dogs as well. With awesome costumes. They have ketchup, mustard, the taco. <laughs> they have a lot of costumes here, too. I'm not going to go through all of them. The cat one, that's cool. The poncho. Look at this, a recliner with a drink and a bag of potato chips. That's funny. The hot dog. They have a bunch of costumes, though. But like I said, I'm not going to go through every one of them, though. Toy Story 4. The Raging Werewolf. Halo. Cool. Dinosaurs. Cool. And then they have props for the costumes here as well. Very cool. Okay, it wasn't that funny. I thought it was cool, but I didn't think it was that hilarious. They have lots of makeup too, so you can really get your costume in a full swing. And then hair color. That's all you need, Kayla. You don't need to dye your hair all all fancy with the expensive dye. Just use that and you're done. Uh, Spray it on and you're done. It doesn't work like 
<laughs> killer clown makeup. Very cool. They have all kinds of hand soaps. Blood Moon Jack-O-Lantern. It's like they're trying to compete with uh, uh, Bath and Body Works, but that's okay because sometimes their stuff's pretty good. Now, if I could find dish soap that's Halloween themed, that would be awesome. Coming over here, oh, they have fake nails and wigs. Extensions, they got eyelashes right up Kat Kayla's alley there. Face and body gems. More hairspray, color hairspray. They have cosmetics here. They have all kinds of different makeup. Halloween cards. Very cool. More cards and stickers. Those are card packs. Here's individual cards here. Whatever crosses your path. Well, now we gotta read it. Hope it's just as special as you are. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween, everybody. Let's finish up here. Little things. Look at the it's like a kitty bat thing. <laughs> Buy three greeting cards, $1.99 or more, and get one Halloween plush for free. $7.99 value. More candy. What are these? Little party favors. Sticky party pack. Like sticky worms and rats. They have the little fangs. More buckets for trick-or-treating. That would never do. That's so small. <laughs> and then here we go. Toys and party favors for those Halloween parties. Everybody's going to be having the blowouts. All the trick-or-treat bags. Look at the kitty one. They get bigger as you go down here. I like that. Now just put pillowcases out. Just get Halloween-themed pillowcases. Bam. Problem solved. What in the heck are these now? Squeeze toy. Ew. <laughs> Ew. That's okay. So we did that. Scented dough. Scented play dough, basically. Halloween mystery pals. You don't even know what you get in there. You get what? Well, guess one of those little guys. Okay. They have eyeball bouncy balls. Love those. What? What's this? Slime with eyeball. Ew, cool. <laughs> Pencils, notepads, etch art. Cool stuff. Activity books. What are these? Little fingers, fake fingers, more Play-Doh. Oh, that's mini slime in here. Cool. Little wind-up toys. Sticky catapult. All right. Finger puppets. Glow-in-the-dark spiders. Mini squeeze toys. Oh, my God, that's so weird. Beaded necklace. Bubbles. Oh, activity booklet. Now i got to pick up what I dropped. Happy Halloween. You go. Bubbles, spider webs. And I think that'll do it. All right, well, that's going to wrap up that look at Meyer here for the Halloween goodies that they have. Oh, man, I'm exhausted. <laughs> that was a lot of stuff in there. Doing it after dinner, and especially after that Steelers game that provided me about a dozen heart attacks. The game we played against uh, the Cincinnati Bengals to open up the 2022 season. Oh. I'm ready for a good night's sleep. I need it. I think next time we go look at Halloween stuff, I'll see if I can find a defibrillator in there, defibrillator, whatever they call it. Because I'll need it, especially when the Steelers play at Acupuncture Stadium or whatever the hell they call it now. It's still Heinz Field. I don't know what that has to do with the Halloween video, but I hope you enjoyed it nevertheless. Thanks for watching, everybody. Take it off. I'll see you guys later. Take care. Stay awesome. And on Kayla's behalf, have a Meyerlicious day. Bye, everyone.